all I wanted to do with that first book was get written. I wrote it three times um, over that seven year period and then turned it in. And then they said they were going to publish it. And I thought, oh, yeah, great. This is, I can hardly wait, you know. And then uh, after it published, Judy Lynn Delray, uh, Lester's wife and the head of the Delray line, called up and said, well, Brooks, as she always said, referred to me, she says, Brooks, what do you think? And I said, it's pretty exciting. And she says, good. Have you started on the next one? And not being a total fool, I said, yep, I'm working on uh, outline work uh, and start right now. Yep. Uh, and uh, I hadn't, you know, even conceived of anything. Um, and then there's the, then the famous story comes about how I wrote the, the next book and it got turned down. I wrote a 400 page book without finishing it um, called something. I can't even remember anymore. So it's been so long ago. It was in the, early, it was in the late 70s, early 80s. And um, sent it to Lester and uh, said, I can't figure out the ending to this book. I'm really stymied here. Can you give me some insights into how I should wrap this up? So I didn't hear anything. And then Lester writes back and he says, well, hard to tell you this, but this book is no good. He says, uh, much as I would like to tell you, it's a good book and you pursue it. This book is flawed in so many ways that there's nothing we can do to save it. And you're going to have to start over. Now, I know that if you choose to go publish it somewhere, someone will publish it, but you will live to regret it. Do not do that. Listen to what I have to say. Look at what I put in the manuscript and so forth. So I called up Judy Lindell Ray, you know, practically in tears and said, you know, what's the, the worry? And he said, Lester, listen to me, Tip Brooks, listen to me, Lester is always right <laughs> and hung up the phone. So I cashiered the book. Oh no, I didn't do it. I got back the manuscript from Lester and he had notes all the way through the book. Every third page, there was a sheet writing, what's wrong here, what's wrong here, what's wrong here? And I read them through. And because I managed to keep a balanced look at it, I found out that what he was saying was in fact true. It was flawed and he had picked out all the bad areas. So I put it aside and said, I'll steal from it, but I won't do it again. Started over with uh, Elfstones. And of course, to this day, Elfstones is probably the best known and most popular of the books. And uh, it's one of the few books where when I read it and I think I wouldn't change anything. I think it's exactly how, what it needs to be. I wanted to do the trilogy by then. I'd made up my mind I was gonna do that third book uh, and do the trilogy. Um, and then, as I told Lester, I want to write something else. And he said, fine, 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 fine. You write something else. <laughs> so <laughs> I, I wrote, wish song turned in all that kind of thing. And th then I said, uh, to Lester, uh, can I, uh, you know, fly out to New York and talk to you about this new series? And, uh, he said, sure. So I flew out and they welcomed me to their place as usual and said, so what do you got in mind? And I said, actually, I don't have an idea. What I need is a concept, you know, an idea of a place to start. Now you read into this, what you think is going to happen. He says, well, I don't know. He says, um, I don't know if there's anything that's just right for you. You might need to do this yourself. And I said, well, I, I would, I just have, don't you have any ideas you could share with me? And he says, well, I, yeah, I, I might have one idea. And I said, okay, so what is it? And he said, no, he says, I don't think you're right for it. He says, it should go, somebody else should do it. And I said, well, at least tell me what it is and then you can, you know, make up your, he said, well, okay, I'll tell you. You know, I can feel the hook now drawing me in. He says, all right, well, this is, there's this man and he's successful and he has a family and everything, but uh, he gets a Christmas catalog and in the Christmas catalog is this magic kingdom. And he gets enamored of the idea of becoming the king of a Mary of a, of a uh, magic kingdom. And, but it turns out not to be anything of what he thought it was going to be. And I said, I, can, I think I can do something with that. I like the idea. And he said, well, all right, I'll tell you what, I'll give you the idea for a year. You go home and write the book and then the, you can keep the idea. But if you don't write the book, I get the idea back. So I agreed. He envisioned Piers Anthony. 
he wanted a Xanth kind of story with lots of slapstick humor and, and so forth. I, being the dark person I am, envisioned that this was a tragedy and that there would be some funny parts, but there would also be the knowledge that the people in his kingdom not only didn't understand him, they wanted him dead. And that became the whole nucleus for creating uh, Landover and Ben Holiday and that story. Well, I loved the cast. I mean, you, how could you not like that cast? You've got everything going from talking dogs to, <laughs> to you know, uh, uh, a girlfriend who turns into a tree. Um, and I thought, you know, this is this is so fun to write because there's so many ways you can go with this story and so many stories to be told with these characters. Uh, and it was easy to write. I was writing those books in six months, you know, which was a lot faster than the Shannara books. Uh, so I, I, I enjoyed them. I got involved with them. Uh, it was easy to come up with the stories and the plots and all of that. Um, and it did, in fact, take me away from Shannara. So after writing three books, I thought, fine, that's good. I have to go back now and, and, and start up with the, with the next Shannara series. I'm, I'm rested. I feel ready to go back. And that's kind of the way it went from there on in, because I just switched back and forth from one series to another.